need your help. Do what I say, and we can avenge this massacre. Take my rifle and watch the road. Mumodak in the car is General Heinrich Hamsel, architect of Stalingrad's misery. He is responsible for the cold-blooded murder of men, women, and children. Not just here, but throughout the motherland. For three days, I have hunted him. For three days, luck alone has saved his wretched life. Sniping your enemy is like hunting any other animal. Fire at the wrong moment and your chance will be forever lost. Patience. If we reveal our position to Hamsel's men, this fountain will be our grave. Now, load your rifle, but hold your fire. Wait until the bombers are directly overhead. The sound of the engines will drown out your shot. Alright, got Ready? a couple of Germans to the right. Shoot now, okay, fire it. He's down. He's down, there's one in the middle. Take him out. Okay, I missed that. Hopefully we can hear that. Okay, to the left. Again. Again. Is he dead? Okay, uh, where is he, where is he, where is he? There he is, there he is. Oh, there's one running. There we go. <laughs> this is actually pretty awesome how this is set up. So this is one of the missions from Call of Duty World at War, but it's on Menavor or Sud Squad 2. Patrol. We must find another route to Amsel. Okay. Go this way, before they discover the dead. Oh man, this game brings back so many memories. But obviously when I last played it, I was playing FPS, first person. And now, <laughs> I'm playing it third. So this is really weird. <laughs> Because obviously we're seeing more of the map. Obviously this is a mod that someone's made for Men of War, but it's really cool. Right, okay. So we're coming through this house General here with Reznov. Save my progress. He inspects each German garrison every day. Alright, let's have a look. Oh, dude, this is where you get shot by a sniper from remember, right? Have a look at the dude, this so it's minable. What's gonna happen? Sniper! Get inside now! <laughs> he just dived through that window. <laughs> yes. Oh, almost got me. We'll have to flush him out before we move on. Follow oh, me! That's so cool. That's so cool! Like, he jumps. He, he deliberately did the, the jump. River. is like from the campaign. There, the building with the banners. He knows exactly where we are. Okay, okay. Take cover behind this bench, so we can snipe him out. I remember it used to be a lot harder on the actual main game. Um, there he is. Good floor, right side. Good Boom. hunting. Nice. The patrols will surely have heard those shots. We need to get moving. German patrol, let them pass. There they are. They have found us. We need to leave now. Hit the floor. Oh no. Here comes the fire. They are trying to burn us out. Stay long. Keep moving. Yep, there's Try a flame for us. Be. Oh man, this mission was so difficult when you played it on Call of Duty though. Um, if I remember right, the bit where you get detected, there was like a dog or something that actually detected they you. But the building. Okay, okay, okay. But if I remember right, obviously this is Men of War, so they don't have oh, actually God, dogs in this game. Alright, keep moving, keep moving. Go, 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 go. There he is, there's Reznov. What's happening? Whoa, okay. Dimitri! 
We thought you were among the dead in the massacre at the square. He was among them, but not one of them. <laughs> yeah, okay. The yeah, I remember that. Because obviously you get blown out the window. Such a move will prevent the German command calling for help. Dimitri and I will provide cover from above. Wait till you hear the screams of dying Germans. Dimitri, this way, up the ladder. This way, comrades. Take positions and wait for the signal. All right, so we're climbing up here. I'm guessing um, to do a second position, a little bit like the, obviously the main story. So obviously. There's a, a few changes from the actual Call of Duty World at War because there's a little cinematic scene where you get blown out the window there if you didn't understand what happened there. Um, obviously Men of War, they can't do that, um, but so far they've done pretty decent on this mod. Um, Alright, so it looks like we're going to be sniping some of these jerrys down here. Do you see the flamethrowers? Exploding the fuel tank will incinerate anyone standing nearby. Okay, okay, shoot a barrel. Well, there's nowhere here now, and that didn't explode. What about that one? Nope, that doesn't explode either. Why have we got exploding symbols on? Okay, it looks like we can actually control this unit. That's pretty cool, because in the actual campaign, it's the AI that control this, so that's pretty cool. Alright, let's get you guys moving up. So it looks like we're controlling Dimitri and this infantry squad that's down here. Okay, comrades, let's get you moved behind this debris here. Oh, this a little bit of um, ammunition or boxes or whatever it is. Okay, they're pretty suppressed. I might have to switch to Dimitri with the sniper. See if we can help cover. Let's get these guys moving up a bit. Go, 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 go. That's pretty cool, man. Like, obviously, like I said, like, if you play Call of Duty World at War, you only play as Dimitri. In this bit, you're like, you know escorting these guys um, it's pretty cool this okay let's see if we can maybe snipe a couple of these guys um, there's some uh, infantry on the right I might have to use Dimitri to flank them though let's see let's see let's see can you get a shot can you get a shot let's see if we can get a shot with a sniper oh, no, I can't really get a shot with him there I might have to switch positions. It's so hard trying to control this dude because I'm not like obviously used to playing Men of War as old squad, especially because it's Call of Duty as well and Men of War. But man, this is pretty awesome. I still like this. Um, all right, let's move Dimitri up to this area so we can flank a little bit. Um, obviously, we need to protect our guys with some sniper power. Let's go, 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 go. Let's keep moving, keep moving. If I remember right, this part is where dogs come running at you and try and kill you, but um, I think we don't need to worry about dogs this time. But so far though, this actually, it is very, apart from cinematics and other bits and pieces, it's pretty accurate and spot on. Okay, let's move up, move up. Alright, let's get our main infantry to move up as well around the, on the main road. Um, okay, that's how that you guys I keep forgetting that like obviously I keep controlling them and then you have to like switch back and stuff It's so weird man. But this is so cool. I love these kind of um, These battles that people make and stuff um, especially how it's pretty um, similar to playing Call of Duty World at War Which basically it is it's one of the campaign missions um, I think this is actually the first Russian campaign mission well campaign mission as the Russians you play on World at War But I'm not 100% sure Okay, Dimitri, get cover behind this box, see if we can cover them. Get some sniper firepower over there. Sniper firepower. <laughs> get some sniper shots. Let's keep oh my god. Our comrades are cleaning the building um. to watch your fire. <clears throat> I can't remember this in the in the campaign, Charge! but okay. Keep firing! I'm happy Let's with that. <laughs> Post. Wow, okay. Oh, 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 take mounting out. Okay, you can technically, you can't see that the AI isn't great. Come on, take my Dimitri, take him out. I don't want to take too much damage. Do you know, the only thing I don't like about this game, right, is that if you take... 
you take damage, you have to restart the whole mission all over again. And there's no like checkpoints on it, which really sucks. You have to like start the whole mission all over again. It's not like actual card uh, where you can like respawn after you die. It's it's so stupid. Okay, take him out. Can you get a shot? Go go take him out. Nice. Follow me. I know a perfect sniping position overlooking the command post. Hold fire. We are too close to our goal to reveal our position. There is nothing we can do for our comrades. Their sacrifice will not go unavenged. The death of General Absent will be just the beginning. Look ahead! The building adorned with flags is the German command General post. Absent will soon be in our sight. The sounds of battle will slash him out. Okay, uh, there he is. Okay, let's take out this general. Let's see how hard it is because I remember this was such a hard part of the mission. Um, okay, can we get him? Boom! Okay, that missed. How could you miss that? You're using a sniper, dude. Okay, I'm manually controlling now. He's dead. Can we get that actually shot on Hamsel here? Come on. Hit there. That missed. He's actually stuck. I think the AI screwed here a little bit. <laughs> there we go. They will be coming for us. We must go quickly before their tanks fire again. Into the river, Dimitri. It is our only chance. Go! Alright, well that is the end of this mission apparently, apart from it being a little bit buggy on the AI side, I think that was really well done, especially obviously because it's men of war and there's only certain things you can do on it for a mod. Um, for the actual campaign as well. That was really cool guys. What do you think? I would love to know your comments down below uh, I think I'll be bringing out more of this kind of gameplay as well in the future um, But I'd love to know your thoughts guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Enjoy the rest of your day